Hi, I'm Beth Kingston, and with me is the always lovely Teresa Collins from Teresa Collins Designs. Hello, my Hello. friend. And she is here to put us in the Christmas spirit today with this super darling, fantastic, easy to put together Christmas notebook. Show us how it's done. Okay, so you're gonna get a composition book. This was 50 cents. I know. Okay, and then I'm just using my paper, and I'm using the Teresa Collins Mega Runner. Mm -hmm. And what I love about it is it's so simple. What I did is I went ahead and pre-cut the paper to match the um, shape of the composition front and back side. Mm -hmm. So okay. you can do this with bigger yeah. notebooks, smaller totally. notebooks. Yeah, totally. And so the adhesive is wonderful. And it's just, you know, I make these books so that I can have a list when I'm shopping and my kids know they cannot <laughs> open this up. And I just put Do it not right. enter. Yeah. And so I'm going to do the back side okay. while you work on the embellishment. Okay, great. I pulled out some of your double-sided die cuts, which I think are the coolest things ever. And I don't know why no one ever thought of that before because it's got printing on the front, but then it's got the same pattern on exactly. the back. I mean, there's so many great... Anyway, I could talk about these all day. But what I'm going to do is insert these into the um, one and a half inch creative sticker. And because these are small, I can actually do two at a time, which is going to save adhesive because you know we all want to save adhesive. Absolutely. And I'm also going to run ribbon through here. And I think this machine is so great for ribbon because if you were using liquid glue, if you were trying to put regular tape on the back of it, it just would be a horrible mess. And this makes it just so easy. And I love that it doesn't get adhesive where you don't want it. That's exactly right. And that's what I love about it. And, and I'm a ribbon girl. I love oh, ribbon. ribbon. But if you're going to put like a wet adhesive, it's going to show the glue on the yep. back side. So this makes it super simple and beautiful. It does. It's not messy. And what I also think is great about this is if you're working on this project and you get called to dinner, the adhesive isn't going to dry. So you can set this aside right. and do it another time. That is so true. And Beth, it's so simple. You decide there are no rules. And the adhesives all the way. I love so to cool. do, you know, you could have it hanging off too, whatever you want to do. So let's put a sticker down here. And you could do this with little leftovers. Yes. I mean, they're so. Can you imagine letting your children do a little <gasps> Christmas book? What a good idea. These would be great neighborhood gifts. Or grandparent gifts, oh, teacher gifts. My oh my gosh. Yeah, We've and just, I'm just finished our I, Christmas list. I, right I'm now. being totally random here. Look, we could add some ribbon. And we are. Pretty much done there. And you don't need that much ribbon. No, That's the great no, thing about we can it. Cut that off, but perfect. Love it. And then we can also, because you've got the bigger die cuts too oh, and double sided, yes. you can run those with yes. your totally right. Mega runner. So let's just pink mega little... runner, might I say? Yeah, that I love so much. The pink. I absolutely am in love. I'm a pink girl, and you know, it's just. But what I love about crafting is there are no rules. That's exactly right. No rules. This adhesive is, is amazing. If Let's you're a more sure. minimalist person, you don't have to put 20 Absolutely. things on there. If you like Absolutely. to cover it, you can. If you want to put photos on there, you can. You can do everything with these two little machines. It's so easy, and what a wonderful gift. And we just did that in two minutes. That's right. So now we're going to go have some lunch. That's right. <laughs> Thank you so much for this. Thank you. For more great project ideas, come check out Zyron on Facebook and Pinterest, or head on over to TeresaCollinsDesigns.com.